Watch this shocking video from the BBC that might as well be Hezbollah propaganda. Well, we're on level minus two in the Al Sahel hospital. You're probably wondering, what are the BBC doing in this Lebanese hospital? Well, I'll leave that to the spokesman of the IDF to explain. Hezbollah has millions of dollars in gold and cash in Hassan Nasrallah's bunker. Where is the bunker located? Directly under El Sahel Hospital. OK, so after the IDF made that announcement, the BBC then went to the hospital to investigate. We've been brought around the hospital by doctors. We've also been allowed to move around on our own. The hospital staff are adamant that there is no hidden bunker here containing millions of dollars of cash or gold, as the Israelis have claimed. Except that's not what Israel said. They said the bunker was under the hospital, but accessed from these two buildings. The entrance is located in the Al Mahdi building and the exit is located in the Al Sahal Center building. This is the bunker. Which is exactly why after the Lebanese reporters from LBCI finished the tour of the hospital, they moved to the building where the actual entrance to the bunker was, only to find the door locked with armed guards on it who told them to stop filming. Pretty suspicious, right? Now, why is it that Lebanese reporters are able to do their job, but the BBC isn't? I'll leave you guys to decide why the BBC chose to make a video in the hospital instead of going to the actual entrances of the bunker.